If you need to do a search for a keyword within a web page when using the iOS version of Safari, because Safari only has a minimal set of control icons at the top of the screen, you will need to use the address bar to run a search. When you select the address bar, the existing web address is highlighted. The on-screen keyboard will also be displayed. We can now type in the keyword that we're searching for. In this example, I'm hunting for the word wireless. As you can see, we are now presented with a list of our search results. At the top of the list are the results of a Google search. This is because Google is the default search engine that my version of Safari is using on my iPad. However, there is also on this page a search which has found 79 matches for the word wireless. If we select Find Wireless, we are returned to our web page and the first instance of the word that we're searching for has been highlighted. At the bottom of the screen, we now also have some controls for searching within this particular web page. We can move backwards or forwards through the words that our search has been able to match. We can see how many instances of a word exists on the page. We have a field to ask another search. And finally, we have done so that we can close our word search.